naked as a storm. Hope they don't notice our camp. Oh, so along the other side here. I've been meaning to try this spot out. You see that? Did you see that amazing bluegill? Sure. That got you real excited, huh? Come on, Arthur. Let's walk down to the beach. I hope we land this monster. Uh-huh. It ain't easy to catch a fish like that with bread and cheese, but... Hmm. Let's try crickets. We might get lucky. Guess we'll see. You found a legendary fish location. So who taught you how to fish? My pappy mostly. I, I lost my mammy and pappy when I was young to cholera. Your mammy? Like I said, I was real young. After that I was on my own pretty much, but I knew horses and fishing. Well, uh, <laughs> just think now you'll never be alone again. Yeah. Oh. You got it. That has got to be the one, right? It might be. Putting up on hell of a fight. Maybe. I don't know. Huh? Oh, come on. Come on. Pull it in. Pull it in. Yeah. Oh, but a good smallmouth bass. I'm keeping you. Let's try another bait. Wait, what was... To a tree. I'm still a prisoner, Arthur. I can't step outside camp by myself for a second. Yeah. I'd be terrified of one of Combs boys gonna come pick me up. When I'm in camp, I got Bill and Sadie whispering in my ear all the time. They're gonna kill me in my sleep. It's like living in a nightmare. Christ. If I'd known you were gonna moan this much, I'd have never have said yes to this. Yeah. Reeling in slowly. Up. Oh. I bet you got the big one there. Not sure, but he feels big. Yeah. Karen, you haven't even caught anything yet. No, that ain't, that ain't the big one. Maybe it is, I don't know. No. 
But we are getting good bass here. A five pound. Yeah. I'm throwing you back. What, you heading back? I don't think we have much chance. We need better bait. You yeah. might see if the stores around here sell anything better. I think I'm gonna head back to camp, Arthur, if that's okay. Sure. Go on, I'll see you later. I gotta head back to camp anyway. Let's go, boy. I'll see you back at camp, Kieran. Despite Karen used to be in O'Driscoll, I actually do like Karen. Oh shit, sorry. And once we were heading back to camp, oh my. Racing Jack, what are you doing? Come on, pal. <laughs> yeah. I think I might as well take a look at the Langer. Ledger. Hey, Lenny. Okay, Lenny. Yeah. Lemoyne wouldn't be my first choice, but this is a good spot. It's just for now. Okay, I'll catch you later, then. Sure. But let's go over here and take a good look. Hi. Good morning. There she is. Watch the wind doesn't change. Oh, shut up, Arthur. <sighs> Let's take a look at the good old Lager. I think I'm gonna contribute like maybe like up to like let's see how much we can be able to get I'm gonna give them three hundred dollars but that's going directly to the camp and now we take a look at the ledger. Hmm. But first things first. Dutch wants Dutch wants something more comfortable. I'm gonna give him this. Is inspired to contribute more. Next in line. Oh, we don't have enough, but hmm, a chicken coop. Some local farms are selling off old crops or old coops. Has been the chicken coop has been purchased, increasing the quantity of Pearson stew. But now we only have a few, only have 31 dollars left. But uh, but anyway, if 
Probably doing the camp a lot. Good morning. Hey. Hey. Oh, say whatever you damn well please, but I tell you, if I don't get out of here soon, I'm gonna kill somebody. And if you don't stop hissing at me, I'm gonna kill you. You come here. What is wrong with you two? I ain't chopping vegetables for a living. Oh, I'm sorry, madam. Was there insufficient feathers in your pillow? I ain't lazy, Mr. Morgan. I'll work, but not this. Well, I ain't cooking work. <sighs> Sadie, what's wrong with you? What is wrong? My husband and I, we shared the work. All of it. I was out in the fields. I can hunt, carry a knife, or use a gun. But I tell you, you keep me here. I'll skin this fat old coon, serve him for dinner. Your damn mouth, you crazy goddamn fishwife. Uh, no. Hey, Don't enough. God Come damn it. You want to head out there? Run with the man? So be it. But we do more than just hunting. We're hunted. And them things hunting us, so they got guns of their own. I ain't afraid of dying. Good. Okay. You need anything, Mr. Pearson? Maybe me and Miss Zad are gonna take a little ride. Yeah. Sure. Here's my list. Can you post this letter for me? Sure. Right there. Cool. Come on, Princess. Are you coming with me then, woman? Yeah. So I've graduated from chopping vegetables to shopping. Shut your goddamn mouth. Okay, I got my repeater. You cool down then yet? I guess. No, I ain't no skull yet. And I sure as hell ain't taking orders from that sweating half wit. I guess we all gotta do our share, Princess. Oh, where's that letter? Are you reading his mail now? Oh, robbing and killing's okay, but letter reading's where we draw the line. <laughs> mm. Here. <clears throat> Dear Aunt Kathy, <laughs> you are something else. I haven't heard from you in some time, so I pray to the Lord above that your health has not deteriorated further. Blah, blah, blah. It's boring. Ooh. <laughs> Wait a sec. Listen to this. Since we last corresponded, I have traveled widely, making no small name for myself. <laughs> <laughs> Before you ask, I am still yet to take a wife, but I can assure you it's not for a lack of suitors. <laughs> <laughs> Expecting mail from a Tassis Kilgore, whatever they changed it to. <laughs> give me that back. We got work to do. Yeah, give me that back. And we're in roads. Excuse me, coming through.
All right. Post a letter. All right. And a letter from Mr. Pearson. What the hell talking about that boy? Okay, no trouble. Thank you. Bye now. Okay. Later, fellas. Nice outfit. I think this is everything. Thanks. Here. Take that for yourself, okay? Thanks. Well, give it back then. Jesus. I didn't ask for any goddamn help. <sighs> Why don't you try? Okay. Come on, lady. Get a move on. All right. Sadie. Not lady. I know. Yeah. So, you get everything? I think so. And some new clothes, I see. Don't start. I can wear what I damn well want. Like I told you, my husband and I shared all the work. Yeah. And some little wife with a flower in her hair making cherry pies all day. Yeah, I don't doubt that. You sure look the part now. Won't be long before you're smoking cigars and playing the harmonica. I'll have you know, I used to love playing the harmonica before. Well, my house and everything I own got burned to the ground. I know. I'm real sorry about what you, uh, you know. Maybe I'll keep my eye out for another one. I don't want no pity. Okay. Treat me equal and no. No. Say the ass for a harmonica. Nothing for me ever again. Mm -hmm. Just don't kill the camp cook. Okay. Hey there. Uh, hey. What uh? What you folks up to? Just heading home. You're in the Morn Raider country. Keep it cool. Please. You need to pay a toll to pass through here. No, I don't think so. You don't think so? How about you pull over right now? Hello? That's what I said. Hey, how's about this? Go! Go, go, go! Let's get the hell out of here. Go! Ah, oh, damn. The Morn Raiders. Oh shit! Ah, oh, damn it! Yeah. He was clearly planning to bushwhack us. Did good. But that's a lot of mess to make near camp. Hope it don't bring anyone sniffing around. 
Are you gonna tell Dutch? Maybe. If he asks. But maybe not. Careful now. So who do they say they were? Lemoyne Raiders? Yeah, something like that. Who knows? Yeah. Anyway, don't you go ribbon piercing about that letter. How dare you? I wouldn't dream of it. Right, you wouldn't. <laughs> 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 I won't be giving you no mail to post anytime soon, that's for sure. Yeah. I just want to peek in that journal of yours. The mind of balls. Not a chance. Not a chance. You get yourself killed then, Miss Adler. Not quite. <laughs> well, I'd like to say I missed your refined conversations, but I'd be lying. I, I enjoyed myself out there. <laughs> yes, we, uh... Mrs. Adler did okay. At shopping? Yes, at shopping. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Don't mention it. I would ride with you again, Mrs. Adler, if you will ride with me. Maybe. <laughs> if you prove you can handle yourself. Well, they say I lack finesse, but I ain't afraid of gun smoke. <laughs> <laughs> we got this, Arthur. You've already done me a big favor today. Okay. Okay, Miss High and Mighty. And nice pants. Completely with okay. Well, out there, uh, hold up. I gotta donate something. Is decidedly lacking on decent meat, Mr. Morgan. Very good. We were getting low. Hey, Tilly. Oh, you want to play dominoes? Fine. Let me ask you a question. If I was to kill Miss Grimshaw, would Dutch be mad? I think, as a general rule, Dutch likes to avoid murder within the camp. I mean, it was that one time, but he was a traitor. Miss Grimshaw, well, Dutch has a soft spot for her. I thought as much. Was she always like this? I ain't quite old enough to know. <laughs> no, of course. So as long as you've known her? She's always liked her swill of vinegar. I'd like to give her a swig of arsenic. Well, just do it discreetly. I will. You fancy a game of dominoes? Sure, why not? Yeah, if sure. I'm playing with you, she'll leave me alone. <laughs> The domino survived Blackwater, but my necklace didn't. Oh, yeah. I thought something looked different. Well, I stole that one. I'm sure I can steal another easy enough. <laughs> I'll keep my eye out for you, too. Tilly has asked for a necklace. Okay, I'll keep an eye out. Okay. Tilly has the highest double. Okay, I'm voicing that one. Nothing here. Okay, I got nothing. Something. Nothing. There we go. Three, three, three. There we go. Nothing on this one. Uh aha, uh -huh. here we go. Uh 
Okay, I got a six. Hosea and Dutch there, got that no. twinkle in their eyes again. Yeah. That usually means trouble. <laughs> well. And three. Domino. Ah. Oh, darn it. Tilly has played all the... Oh, so you she wins. Too much for me. <sighs> Pinkertons can see you now. Killer, <laughs> bank robber, dominoes player. <laughs> you gotta keep them on their toes. Yeah. The way you wanted to get arrested, though. Imagine the newspaper headline. <laughs> well, keep your eye out there. Hope I get a good hand. Hmm. Let's see. I need to play my cards or my dominoes, right? Putting down a five. What do you have, Tilly? Hmm. Uh, I'll place that one down. Okay, that's a four, and has nothing. Don't place it. Oh, oh wait, I can get that. Right here. Oh, come on. Here, it ain't worth much. Damn, that's not pretty. Oh, six. A six. Come on. Give me that six. Don't place anything down. No, da oh, come I can't on. Can't do much with that. I can do that. Give me a four or something. Now all I need is a six. Put down that six. Come on. Oh, man. Oh, there we go. Don't put down that six. Domino. There. Domino. Yeah. <laughs> you ain't getting nothing from me, ha. Huh? No bonus points over, boy. <sighs> okay. I'll play another round. All fives. The player immediately scores the total of the... the... Okay. Oh, so the one with the domino starts first. No, actually that isn't, but... Okay, so... Let's start off with... Let's start off with an all six. Uh, nope, gonna take that one and put it for the four. Great. Ah, a four and a five. There we go. Put down something. A one. There we go. <sighs> Nothing. Well, whoops for you. 
Perfect. Perfect. There, but all for nothing. Ah, oh, come on, Tilly. You're gonna get Domino, aren't you? Well, I can put a two right there. This ain't looking great for you. Don't put a two right it's there. Trouble, my friend. Oh, Domino! Yeah. Sorry, ain't worth much. Oh, I'm catching up, Tilly. I'm actually having fun here. Okay, same thing like last time, starting off with a six. This ain't worth nothing. You know, I think I like this spot better than what you overlook now. <laughs> yeah. Putting that down. Give me that three. Domino! <laughs> no tiles left. Oh, sorry. Here. Oh, wood tie. But one, but one more. One more, and I'm probably gonna get. Oh, wait, the target score up to a hundred. Hmm. <sighs> Placing that down. Poison down that two to the three. Oh, there we go. Oh, all right. I don't have anything else for that, but hopefully, what you got once. What'd you have to put down? Oh my god! Oh my god! Domino again! Yes! Come on! Yes! Winner! Uh, that was fun. That was fun for Domino. That's fun for Domino. Well, here we are, Tilly. Moved again. Hey, 
impression. Hey, Sean. John. Join the party here, Morgan. Leave some drink for the rest of us. Cheers to you, too, English. It ain't just for you. Okay, Morgan. <laughs> Take it easy with that stuff. This is taking it easy. Oh, I had to give her the request. Here you go. Found this. Said you lost yours. Oh, it's beautiful. Thank you. Here, please take this. It's the least I can do. Okay. Two health cures. Must be nervous being this close to the water. Oh, don't you start. I'm <laughs> <laughs> just looking out for you. Well, I should get back to it. Okay, so. We got Mr. Gr Mr. GR. And we got to go see Dutch over at the train. Over at over in over in roads but how much time do I have left? Hmm. That's probably that's probably gonna have to be it for this episode. So I'm going to save up here. But yeah. Mm. But that's going to be it for this episode, guys. If you guys enjoyed this episode, make sure you guys leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and hit the bell icon to get notified about our latest videos. I live stream Tuesdays through Saturdays, 8 a.m. to 9 p.m., and on Fridays and Sundays if I can, 6 p.m. to 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Check it out on my channel. And, uh, yeah, well, mm. me, me and Dark are starting to play Helldivers. I'll have that one episode of me and, and Dark playing Helldivers 2 very soon. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out, everybody.